everyone welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to be doing a what's in my bag work edition uh, with the kate spade chelsea large tote so here is the bag i have multiple videos on my channel if you would like uh, to see kind of my first impressions my opinions wear and tear all those sorts of things on this particular bag and i will link those videos in the description box if you are interested but aside from that this video is going to show what i carry with me to work in this bag on a day where i have to bring a ton of stuff to work so normally i do like to downsize and i try to keep things to a minimum just because once you start filling a bag up with a ton of stuff it gets really really heavy so so this is more of a rare look of what I would bring and even then you can still fit a ton more items in this bag than I show. Uh, also very different in terms of what I would obviously pack this with as a carry-on bag which I'm not going on a trip anytime soon but when the time comes I'll definitely do a video if you would like showing you what I pack this with for a carry-on. So aside from that though I actually also don't utilize all the different pockets as a work bag. Um, I definitely use them more so when I'm using this bag as a carry-on but as a work bag I mostly just use the main compartment and the pockets in the main compartment. I actually don't utilize every single pocket in this but aside from that it's still obviously so helpful to have the different compartments it really just helps to keep everything very organized and so i'm gonna just start this off in the front pocket i actually usually just stick my phone in there i'm recording on my phone but that is definitely what i just quickly stick in there whatever i have on hand that i need easy access to is really helpful to just um, put in that front compartment and aside from that i'm going to move to the inner is it pocket right here so kind of on the back side of the front there is a nice roomy zipper pocket and in there I would stick things like this little long jump pouch this has lip balm it has kind of some medication and it has you know some eye drops those sorts of things so that easily goes in there I would also stick uh, my little key case that goes in there I'm gonna fit my AirPods. I can't leave the house without these. I love having AirPods and I actually do utilize this at work as well. So that easily goes in there. And then I would stick in my wallet. I'm currently using this uh, Louis Vuitton little wallet and I would also stick that in there. And aside from that, I think that is pretty much all I would stick in there. So I would just zip that up so it's really secure. And then again, on that same inner facing wall or side of the bag there's two actually roomy slip pockets in there so in one of those pockets i would stick my physical planner this is a small pocket sized uh, moleskin planner and i have been using this model for over a decade now i absolutely love this so this easily fits in the pocket in one of the pockets and then in the other pocket i would stick in my little pencil case so this is a ted baker uh, rose gold pen case it actually came with a matching pen as well but i just use it to fit a couple of these muji pens that i absolutely love and these are specific to my planner but even then you can fit a ton more things in there as well you can even fit like usb sticks that sort of thing but that will easily slip in the other slip pocket and i would also carry my uh, work pass so i would just stick this in as well along with the pencil case. So that's pretty much what it looks like right now. And uh, moving on to the very main compartment. So the next thing is actually my lunch. And I'm just going to use this thermos from Swell as an example, but normally I'd probably carry a little bit more for lunch. I Just one thing to note that is I find really interesting is that other videos that I've seen for you know, what's in my bag, especially for work, I notice a lot of people don't normally mention bringing their lunch, but that is something that I really try my best to do every day when I go to work. Um, it saves a ton of money in the long run, so this obviously easily fits. And I normally actually stick it in this little uh, bagu kind of nylon bag. And I just stick it in there and I tie it up and it just adds a little bit security in case you know anything spilled or anything like that. So that is that and I'm just going to stick this in the bag. And in terms of like a water bottle or like utensils or anything like that, I actually have those all at work. So I don't usually bring that with me. So next, what I would stick in the main compartment is this long chomp pouch. And this just has all of my essentials that I might need in the office that day. Uh, so I have things like this hand cream in case my hands get dry. I have uh, this little battery charger just in case. Um, and I usually carry this with me on a day-to-day -day basis as well. I have this small jar of face cream as well. 
And then I also have this pouch that I also do carry with me usually in my smaller bags. Uh, but this has just like a mirror, it has some dental floss, has some other medication, some feminine products, that sort of thing. So that fits nicely in this pouch as well. And so this obviously goes in the main compartment as well with where my lunch is and everything. And lastly, in that kind of main compartment, I'd stick in this notebook. I also did a recent video on this. This notebook cover as well as the notebook is from the Coach Ellet. And I have been really loving this for work. I also have an additional notebook in here and some other documents that I have slipped in there as well. So this easily fits in the main compartment. And then as you'll probably see, there is a ton of room still and I'm nearing the end. So as you can see, there's still a lot of room definitely room for a water bottle, an umbrella if it's bad weather, that sort of thing. And then in the very back pocket, it's actually a small kind of padded compartment where you can stick like an iPad or a laptop. So that is what I'm going to stick in there. So first off is this uh, iPad. This is like an old iPad Pro. It was like the 9.7 inch or something like that. So it's with the nice rose gold back, but this actually fits nicely in this really thin, um, just like felt cover and that can easily fit in that compartment and then lastly again I would normally carry this with me on a day-to-day -day basis But if I do need to carry a laptop um, I have a 13 inch laptop that fits perfectly in there um, One thing to note I think someone had asked me if a 15 inch laptop fits it doesn't in terms of that specific back padded pocket um, so I'm actually going to go ahead and button this but as you can see, both of those items fit perfectly in that pocket. Um, so you can't fit uh, a 15 inch in that pocket. Just a note if you're interested in using that specific pocket though. But yeah, that is a realistic look of what I would pack this bag in particular for work. Um, and as you can see, again, if I lift it up, this is very heavy, but it can still fit a ton of things. Uh, but I wouldn't advise anyone to overstuff it because considering how heavy it is already, uh, I can't even imagine fitting even more things in this. But yeah, that is a what's in my bag. And if you have any questions, definitely leave them down below. I will do my best to answer those. Otherwise, thank you as always for taking the time to watch my video, especially for those that have subscribed. I really appreciate it. Uh, aside from that, I hope you all have a fantastic day and I'll see you in the next video.